well, to just kick off the very last day of me playing the Sega Genesis Mini, we've already played every single game except for the last six, and I'm not going to lie, I feel like I saved a lot of the really interesting ones, both story-wise, due to their development, stuff like that, and gameplay-wise. So, really, without further ado, let's just dive right into this goodness, and let's start with Alicia Dragoon. This one definitely looks interesting, uh, yet another game I have not played on the Genesis, and I'm going to be using my six-button uh, retro-bit controller today, because it's the last day, might as well have all six buttons, right? Instead of the the one that comes with it, uh, the three-button controller, which you get two of. And fun fact about that, these bad boys actually hook into PCs. I was just using uh, an emulator with it earlier today, and this totally worked. So not only do you get two controllers for the Sega Genesis Mini, but for emulation as well on a computer. So even the games that you didn't get on here and you want to play on your computer, you can still use the same controller. Classic Sega feel and beautiful, oh, just beautiful controllers. So I'm very happy that now I have multiple Sega controllers that I could use with my computer. I probably should have read that. I wasn't going to though, so straight into the action. Whoa, what did I do? I hit the A button. Select. Oh, you can pick what kind of monster you have? We'll leave it on this guy for now. There we go. B button. Uses up my lightning. Ah! Oh, good. Ah! Slowly charges up. So, I was very concerned at first thinking, oh crap, I'm just going to run out of lightning. Oh my gosh! This is intense! Okay, stand here for a second. Let's recoup. There we go. Got some lightning back. Ugh. Oh my gosh. Ah! Man, there is a lot going on on screen right now. Oh man, I'm not doing super well either. Let's trade out our dragon. See what this fire dude does for us. Nice. It just rams into enemies and catches them on fire. What else could you ever ask? Oh, well, I think these mushrooms are hurting me. I'm trying to avoid being touched by them. There we go. There we go. Oh, no, I'm out of lightning. Let it charge. Oh, gosh. Woo. Break all of them. Do I have to break him? There we go. Yeah, I found some health. C button jumps. B button attacks. A button changes our our companion, it looks like. Ow! And he doesn't seem to have a whole lot of use right here. Let's trade him in for a lizard. Ooh, it's like a flying salamander. <laughs> When he throws out boomerangs. Okay, let it charge up a little bit. Oh! Demo. Wonder why it flashed demo on the bottom right for a second. Whoa! Big dudes. Let's see if I can heal him. Oh, no. That just beefs up my stuff. Alright, let's see what looks like a hawk. Ooh. Oh, I just gave that companion like an upgrade. Wow. Well, hells yeah. Whoa! 
Oh, he landed right on top of me. I don't think I could hit him from that angle. I don't really know what this companion does yet. I have not seen it do anything. Oh, I should have switched back to my dragon to heal him. Ah! There we go. Alright, I do not like this guy. I'm going to switch him out. And my dragon's a little jacked up, so we'll wait until I find some health. Oh, back into the demo. I think it just flashes that really fast, right? When it uh, goes into a video or a cutscene. Uh, yes, sorry, I was just reading a comment that was asking if I... Uh, still played the MFL Switch game a little bit after reviewing it, and if I still think so highly of it. And yeah, uh, they actually released uh, some new DLC for it, and it was only two bucks, so I got it. Up updated the players a little bit, gave them some like new models and stuff like that, which was pretty cool. A couple new teams. Uh, but yeah, I really enjoyed the hell out of uh, Mutant Football League. I thought it was super fun. And I mean, for being football season, I still gotta play a little bit of football here and there. Ah! There we go. Kicking some butt. Ah, yeah. Ah! The only thing about Mutant League Football that I, or Mutant Football League, I keep mixing that up backwards, uh, that I probably would have done differently is buy it on the PlayStation 4, to be honest. I would have really liked to have had those achievements to try to get. Switching to my dragon so I could heal him. And you know, just for a little bit better graphics. Not that it ran terribly on the Switch, but I can safely assume it would have ran a little bit smoother on PS4 or the Xbox One. heal this guy up a little bit more and then take my dragon back whoa ah these guys are real turds ah oh man Oh gosh. You guys are like the first boss. Ah! Ah! I meant to switch him out because he was getting his butt kicked. Let's see if this guy actually does anything. Come on, come on. Shoot! I ran out of lightning and I got my butt kicked! No! Heck yeah, dude! Of course, any time with the information, wow, that game over screen is a little wacky. Come on, let me continue. I'm a frog master. Nice. Oh, no, it's one of those games where if you die, you just start over, just like Comic Zone. Bummer. Let's see. Again with the demo on the screen. And now that I think I got a little bit better handle on what's happening, we could get a little bit farther.
Let's see, I think the fire guy handled these guys a little bit quicker, these damn mushrooms. Here we go. for me. Woo. And you let that thing charge up all the way and it rocks people. Problem is letting it charge up all the way. They always seem to send like one or two at a time. There we go. Oh. suckers. Alright, change back to the dragon so we can heal him one. And let's just leave it on the dragon. He seems to be kicking some butt for us. Yeah. So I'm hoping that I actually use that upgrade on one that's an attack. Companion. Hopefully his attacks will be much stronger. He can start taking out fools a lot faster. Nice. Looks like he spits two flames of... Oh, no. Oh, I missed that, didn't I? Yep. Oh, well. Ooh, here we go. Nice. Caught them in that golden lightning strike. Heck yes! Yeah, the dragon totally rocks when he's a level higher. It's only when I try to do something in a cutscene is when it tells me demo. So I can't skip any of these cutscenes. Well, I did just hit the start button. Maybe you can. There we go! Yeah, just hit the start button. You can skip it. Oh, wrong button. Bam! Got all you turds in one go. So what, equi what, what equipment would you need to start streaming? Uh, pretty much just a computer that can handle it, of course. Uh, and then I have an Elgato 60 HDS. And that's pretty much, it's just a standalone streaming device that you plug in whatever console you're using. So I have an HDMI cord going into it and an HDMI cord coming out of it into the TV that I'm playing on, and then it just sends a USB uh, cord to your computer. Whoops. Let's try this guy out for a little bit. Uh, and then you have to download, or well, you don't have to, but I've been using OBS, which is a, uh, a program that lets you stream onto things like Twitch and other platforms like that. I'll upgrade my fire guy. Yeah. So really, it doesn't require a whole lot. It just takes a little bit of time to get, I think, used to it. Probably the best way to put it. Get some fire, dude. Oh, he's not helping. I should have just upgraded my dragon again.
Yes! Having a level 2 dragon just wasted that guy. Ah. Easy peasy that time, holy crap! Stage 1 cleared! 15 minutes, 36 seconds. You know? I want to see what stage 2 is like, just a little bit, and then we'll go on to the next game. Because I get a feeling every single one of these games, I'm going to be like, oh, let's play for longer. <laughs> let's see. I will... Nah, I'll carry around my dragon. He seems to kick the most butt. Whoa! Okay, so... Don't land on those for long. Oh, you can go in the water, too. Damn, everything's hitting me now. Go backwards. You always go backwards when you can in an old video game because that means there's something hidden there. Ah! Get my dragon some. Alright, let's get the dragon out of here. He's just getting his butt kicked. Oh, I have to... Okay, never mind. Let's change him then. I don't want him getting too beat up. Oh my gosh, now I'm getting beat up. Don't die. There we, did. There we go. Oh, I don't think I'm done yet. I just grabbed two fairies, but neither of them. Oh, there you go. Oh, thank goodness. Now. Ah. Oh man, they both went at the same time. Now. Oh nope, they're just timed. I need to be paying more attention. Darn, I died. I did get a continue, though. But that's okay. Like I said, we got a lot of really cool games to go through today. So. Alright, thank you, man. Have a good day at work. I know how it goes. Sometimes you just got, got to go back to doing what you have to do. <laughs> Alright. Uh, so we've played... Alicia Dragoon. That's it. Yes. Okay, good. I really confused myself there for a second. Let's go to a classic. Shinobi 3! If I remember my Shinobis correctly, I think I would have rather, rather had the Revenge of Shinobi. Which I think is the second one. I don't know. The names are very confusing. Okay. But yeah, this one's still really fun too. And if you've never played a Shinobi, you're missing out. Some fun stuff. This is just classic. Kind of very similar to Ninja Gaiden. With really cool ninja stuff, but also some crazy futuristic stuff a little bit farther in. And I'm hoping I can make it to the uh, the horse race part, so you guys can see that, because that's pretty cool stuff. Wait for that to explode. Bam, fool. Ah! 
She messed up my power up. Oh, damn. I hate it when it looks like you can duck something, but you can't. It still just barely nicks the top of your dome. Ah! There we go. For some reason, I thought the screen locked into place whenever you had to fight those guys. To make it a lot less... Hard to... Ah, keep track. There we go. And one more time. Good stuff. Oh, this is the one that locks into place. Dang it. Ah! We'll figure this pattern out soon enough. There it is. Getting some. Oh yeah. Yeah, right in your face, turd. Dang it. There you go. I knew I could duck that one. Don't just jump straight in, people. You gotta climb the rope. I know. First time I played this one, I totally kept missing it. And I was like, why can't... That jump's too big! <laughs> I just kept missing the rope. Super obvious, but... I just wasn't looking for it. Woo! Aw, oh, damn. Dude got me anyway. Lost my power up. Thanks a lot, stupid ninja. Whoops. There you go. Come on. Ooh, I thought I timed it poorly. I just gotta hit this guy again three times. And... Yeah. One more time. Nice. Whoop. There we go. Jumping off the walls, I don't know why. But at first it always takes me a minute just to get used to it again. Why did I turn around when I threw that? That was weird. Right in the face. Ah! Ah, oh, crap. There we go. Yeah, a little bit of heart. Oh, I forgot that you can run. All you have to do is double tap in a direction. And you can sprint. There it is. Whoop! Ah. So you just gotta jump over him when he does that crap. And you just gotta strike him right before he attacks you. As you can see, I'm sure. Oh, man. Yes, there we go. Getting into the groove now. Oh, went a little early on that one. Oh, went super early on that one. 
Whoops. There we go. Yeah. I remember though the first time I fought this dude, I was so confused. I was like, what the hell am I supposed to do? Did it drop something? I oh, know. Round clear, yeah! Defeated that turd. That's right. 25? Really? It's only been five minutes? Alright. That's what's up. Ah ha ha! The horse part. This part's awesome. Oh yeah, they jump out of those. I thought I had to hit those to get like a power up or something. Yeah, you can pretty much predict when they're gonna be there. Oh no, that means you gotta jump something. Oh yeah. Oh, I missed him. I think the hardest part about this one is if you don't have enough shuriken and you don't know when to jump to grab them. And jump. There we go. Oh, I missed that one again. Yeah, I got the extra life. Nice. Got him. <laughs> A little bit of extra health. Thank you. All right, this is when it gets real. Ah! And you have to jump the freaking spears with your horse or else it hurts you. Ah, see? I keep forgetting that you have to do that because you're just like, oh... I hit the guy. I'm fine. You're not. Ugh, you gotta jump the spears. It's so hard to do. There we go. That time I did it. Damn. Ooh. I missed him, but at least I also missed the spears. Ah. There we go. Run, horsey, run! And then this is when it gets into, like, wait, what year is this? I thought we were in, like, feudal Japan or something. Nope. Whoa. Ow, damn. Gotta get those big shielded dudes while their freaking boomerang is out. There we go. Oh, crap, he ducked. Ah. Nice. Whoa! Always forget those guys duck. Dirty turd burglars. Oh, I was hoping it was health. Maybe this one will be health. Oh, shoot. Nope, more shuriken. Not a bad thing, but uh, could definitely use some hearts. Oh man. Whoop, whoop. Bam, bam, bam. It has been a long time since I've gotten to this part. I totally forgot what was going to happen. I thought they were going to drop in on me. Nope. I'm okay with this. <laughs> oh, now they're going to start dropping in on me, I think. Maybe? Nope. Never mind. I lied. I don't mean to lie, I just do it every once in a while. 
Get this box. Darn it. No. Oh, good. Oh, there were two boxes there. Get this one. Bam. Whoa, whoa. No. It's so hard to grab onto those damn poles when you can't see them. Oh, and I got to start all the way the hell down here. All right. Now, I'm a little bit more aware of what the heck is going on. I will try to not mess up this time. And luckily, they still give you a, a hearty amount of shuriken. Still at 50. Not a ton. But that's okay. Definitely have had way less. Give me those. Oh, man, I missed it. Again. Nope, I'm not going to go for it. I think I'm... Oh. No, jump up. Oh, no. Oh, no. I got crushed. Blah. Oh, man. Let's try to see if we can make it past that part. And then we'll move on to another one. Or the next game, I should say. See if I can get all the boxes this time. Hey, yeah. Do I have to grab on the... These parts? I'm trying to learn... Where the heck... Oh! I have to hit up. To grab on. I see. That's what I was doing wrong. No, oh, I missed it. I missed it. Oh, no. No, no. Unfortunate timing with the machine gun. Oh. I tried. <laughs> I almost got there, but that machine gunner just kept shooting him right at the wrong moment. But, I mean, that's what he's there for. He's there to mess you up. You can't get mad at him. Could you lay down, buddy? Put your head on the pillow. Sorry, give me a second. Get in bed, buddy. All right. Let's see, we have a ton of these left. Let's do Wonder Boy in Monster World. What did I tell you? Did I not save a ton of, like, the coolest ones for the last day? I feel like I did, and I hope you all think the same. Because these were all a handful that either I just hadn't played, or I've, I've played and I knew they were good. So, excited to make it through all of them. Then the peace was shattered by an invading army of Pinochle. Oh, mon monsters. Vowed to defeat them and make the land peaceful again. All right, cool. Got to hit down to come out of the house. I didn't even show you my ninjutsu powers in Sh uh, Shinobi 3. Whoops. Maybe I should have done that a couple times. That would have helped. shows their health too all right so on the six button controller the top three don't do anything I assume the a button will be my magic I'm not sure how it works yet but we'll figure it out when we find it. we'll try to use it on that snake over there
All right, so we can't buy the boots because I don't have 30 gold yet. Ah! Whoa, yeah, so you hold the A button and then you hit, to use the fire right now, I had to hit left on the D-pad. So that's pretty cool. It looks like you'll be able to hold two magic spells at once. And they're probably all seeking spells like that. Entry is prohibited. Go away. Fine, you don't want to be a dick about it. Ooh, where are we going now? Oh good, you don't die in the water. <laughs> Little crab makes me think of Shantae. Totally looks like something that you'd fight in that those games. Nice, they're all giving me five. I'll be able to buy those boots before you know it. Sorry, monkey. You looked very sad that I cut you, but if you're gonna give me hearts, I'm just gonna have to cut you. <laughs> all right. Pretty fun that you can lay on the ground and poke. Yeah, yeah. sure you have to do that to some enemies. I don't have to do that to any of them yet. Oh, I was just starting to think maybe the uh, the gold goes down every time it jumps. But I don't think it does. I was just getting a couple of fours when I thought they were all going to be fives. But then I did get a six when it didn't touch the ground at all. Hmm. Curious. How the heck do I get to that? Whoop, whoop. Only three gold on that one. Because it bounced, maybe? Who knows? Can you dive into the water? Doesn't look like it. Not that I know of yet. No! These jumps are a little hard to make. Ah, you really gotta be on the edge. Damn. Let's just keep going. There we go. Ah. <laughs> okay, I'm not making that. Let's do this now. Oh! Man, those are hard jumps to make. No! Darn, lost the gold. Alright. Okay, let's see if we can make this jump. Wait for him to stop, and then jump. Oh no! Ah! You can ride a jellyfish. Can I, or did I just squash it? <laughs> okay. Ah. Oh, that's tricky. Oh, that's going to take some, a little bit of practice. Here we go. Darn it. Oh, my gosh. These are a little slow, these controls. On the uh, the uptake of just taking off. Okay. No. I really gotta jump all the way over as much as I can. Here we go. Yes, there it is. Very happy you were a bad guy. I would have felt so bad cutting a mushroom that wasn't bad. Welcome to my inn. You can have a good night's rest for f ten gold. Hell no. I'll find health somewhere. Huh. Oh my gosh.
Shoot! Forgot that he was three hits. You know what? Maybe I should stay in the inn. Ooh, a weapon shop. Yes, please. Oh, what is this? Cost 80 gold. Oh. Hmm. Do I buy a chain mail or do I wait a little bit longer just so I can hit people harder? We'll do that one. Who are you, lady? Huh. Oh, there's a shield! Hmm. You know what? Let's rock the shield and the knife. I think I gotta equip it, though. Get in bed, buddy. Sorry again. Just does not want to take a nap today. That'll happen when you go to a, a party and have way too much soda. Dude, why am I doing worse? Heard? It is time to go to the inn because I am very concerned at half a heart. Uh, yeah, I don't want to die. Hey. fun though it's just like a really simple RPG oh oh so you could save at the same time in the inns so do you have to pay money to save that would kind of suck especially if you just ran into a place because you know that price is just going to go up slowly as you make your way through the game. And you just have no dough when you get there. That would really suck. But of course now we have save states. So, you know, save when the hell you want. Some medicine as well. Let's keep rolling. Damn it. I'm trying to look at the time here. 44. Oh, I think I need to keep moving on to the next game. fun though simple but of course like you saw when you buy a new item it'll affect your stats it's a very classic RPG elements Ooh, locked by music that's pretty cool well I'm definitely gonna come back at some point and play a lot of this game because 
seems interesting. I want to see where the story goes and just how crazy some of these monsters get. I hope they just get straight up bizarre. Uh, but we'll, we'll count that good for now. Alright, now. Gonna play some Darius. That's right. I'm not waiting for that one. Even though you'd think I would do that one last. I want to do it right now. Because I believe it never got an American release on the Genesis. If that's correct. It's either American release or just even a release at all on the Genesis. I can't... I can't really remember. I'm not a... Not a hundred percent. Okay. So C button dro shoots your machine gun. Uh, B shoots these little missile things. Oh. Ah. I got none of them. Crap. Yes. A button also shoots your your machine gun. So you can pick A or C. Definitely going to be using C and B. Just a more comfortable thumb layout for me. And none of the buttons do anything on the C, uh, the six button controller again. Oh, damn, they hit me. I didn't know they blew up like that. I thought I destroyed it. It, it totally destroyed me, though. Come on, come on. Drop something cool, no! Oh my gosh. Ah! Oh, they made me wait on purpose just so I couldn't get that green ball. Whoa, game over already. <laughs> Good job, me. That's pretty dang fun, though. I think I'm a little bit bigger fan of Thunder Force 3. It just seems a lot faster. Handles a little bit better, I think, in my opinion. No, I missed him. I missed him. Ah. Well, this is just going to lead to nothing. Nice. Oh, I hit the wall, huh? Balls. Oh, I see. Each color... Uh of enemy gives you a different color bubble. That's what's up. All right. We can we can deal with this. Come on, baby. Yeah. Oh, and I touched the ceiling. Like a goob. That was great. Oh, ah, ah. Haha. I made it through. Okay. So he's going down. Come on, come on. Oh, I missed him. Ah. Uh, I need that green. Oh, now I ran into a wall again. Darn it. That's okay. That happens. Definitely something you gotta practice with these games. You know, not dying. But yeah, going back on the... Uh... Oh my gosh, right off the bat. Terrible. Going back on the uh, conversation of the controllers. Seriously, I think there's only like... Hmm. Four games? Is it four? On this console that actually used the six-button controller? So... And I don't, I don't know why they gave the Japanese one the six-button controller. That just seems a little biased. Like we... Well, like I talked about, I think, yesterday. But it makes more sense to just not include it, almost. Because why would you? Uh, I'm sure they're more expensive to create. And, uh... Whoa, whoa. Come on, shield, hold up. Oh, man, there goes my shield. No, no. Didn't notice that guy on the bottom. This is the farthest I've made it so far, though. Die, 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 die. 
Oh, they didn't give me blue orbs each. I was hoping for that. Oh my gosh, look at that. Made it. Got it. Nice. Ooh. There we go. Just run through them if you have to. Whoa, wow. I really should just be... Oh, no! And there I go. Hell yeah, I made it a lot better that time, though. Let's see. All right. Cool, cool. We're still doing great. Let's look at the options. Normal. Bosh. Bleh. Boss. Rush mode. Normal. Oh, my gosh. Boss type. 26 bosses. Woo! Oh, there's... I guess it depends on what ship you're using. Rapid off. All right. We just changed everything that we could, I believe. And let's try this. Zone A, yeah. A huge battleship. King Fossil is approaching fast. Wonder what makes this ship easier. This one you actually have to hit the button to shoot. It doesn't you can't just hold the button down. That's uh that seems like that'd make it harder. Oh my gosh, darn. We're jumping, of course, right into the boss battles when we have no business doing that. But you know what? Oh! Whatever! That was a slow death, crazy fish. Get out of the way. So yeah, the only thing about this ship that's different is you can't hold the buttons down. You have to constantly tap the button to shoot. That doesn't make this easier. I think they mixed up their ships. There we go, there we go, there we go. Shooting. Oh my goodness, dude. Ah! Yes, we got all of them that time. Ah! Ah! Okay, my shield is already gone. Come on. Oh no! Game over! <laughs> oh well. Let's see what's happening with my phone here. Lots of things happening all at once, apparently. Okay. Nothing too crazy. Let's, uh... Let's change this back to normal. But let's try it with Tiat. Tiat. Oh, that's what the rapid was. I turned the rapid off. I see. So it wasn't the ship's fault. It was my fault. See, now it's back on. Cool. Cool. Uh, I don't see what's still easier about this ship. Maybe it just has faster weapons? Or maybe the enemies are weaker? Damn, I kept missing him. Yeah, beefed up missiles. Whoa. Got bombs times two on my beefed upness. Yeah, these dudes are definitely going down way faster than they were before. So maybe it's just the uh, enemy health points. Crap. Oh, and you don't lose your build up or your, uh, your upgrades. That's what's up. This is definitely probably the way you should play through this game first. Unless, you know, you're just really good at shmups. And you're like, Psh, rookie fool. I would not need such uh, niceties for my playthrough. 
I'm only okay at these, so... Ah. I need all of them I can get. Give me that, yeah. Bam, bam, bam. Come on, no, get out of here. Oh! I, I didn't even do as well as I did, I think, the last time. But that's pretty dang fun. So, sweet. Another great shmup on the system. Just covering every cool freaking thing they can. Fantasy Zone. Ooh. Let's do that one. Or, well, no, we just did a shmup. We'll wait on Fantasy Zone. We'll do Gunstar Heroes. Yeah! Man. Gunstar Heroes is just a blast. I don't know how people that have played Sega haven't played a Gunstar's Hero. Probably because it's only on the Genesis, I believe. I don't know. I'm not going to act like I know a lot. I just know that this game is amazing. And if you haven't played it on Genesis, just get a Genesis Mini. I mean, shoot, it's probably the same price now. Free shot or fixed shot? Free shot, let's do it. We'll just continue, just continue. You can change all your starting weapons and stuff like that. I do not feel it terribly necessary. Because you can get upgrades as you're playing through the level as well. So. Why make it all complicated and... There we go. Heck yes, look at this screen shake. <laughs> that was crazy for a minute. Oh, there's a little bit more. Ugh. I like this weapon, but at the same time, if there's more than like three people on the screen, you will never shoot who you want to shoot. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Turd, stop jumping at me. There we go. Got a little bit of health back. Come on. Just keep shooting it. We almost got it. There it is. I like the way they show their health as just numbers. So it's like a number countdown. We'll keep this. Yes. Oh! This thing just wrecks through people. There we go. There we go. So if you've played this game before, tell me, are you a fixed person with the guns? Or are you a, uh, a free runner like me? So I feel like I have to be running. Oh, come on. How have I not taken any of you out? I was hoping that would work. Bam, there you go. Oh, shoot. Dude's trying to freaking kick me. Not on my watch, dude. Boss is approaching. Bravo, man! Mwah! Oh, yeah, this thing. There we go. Oh, no. Oh. Run through while you're flashing. Defeated? Really? That was quick. So yeah, you hit the A button to change your weapon. I believe you can only carry two at a time. B is to just shoot like crazy. You can hold it down. Whoa! I don't know why I fell down like that. And 
not defeat this damn arm? I guess not. Here we go. Running away! Oh my gosh. Oh, good. Definitely needed that little bit of heart. Whew. I'm only at 33. With another boss approaching. Oh, bring it on you, weird little turds. Now. Oh. Dang it, dang it. Man, I get hit. Oh, one more time, I'm pretty sure I'm down. Yep. Continue? Hells yes! Where am I? Boss approaching Bravo Man, no! I don't think it matters where on his body you shoot him. But. No, yep. I guess not. I've been doing this wrong for years. I kept trying to just shoot him in the head. Defeated. Just let these guys keep bouncing into my... Oh! Stop shooting me, you dick! Yeah. Pretty sure if you have two of the same weapon it up like beefs up whichever weapon it is because yeah these shots I'm firing now are huge compared to what they were before so hopefully that'll help oh my gosh those things can just hit you continuously Come on, jump out of there. There we go. Ugh. There we go. Stage clear! Yeah, yeah! some fools. Ugh. Whoa. I was not expecting that from that little machine. We'll use this one for a while just so we can not have to worry about where we're aiming. There we go. Here 
Very nice, very nice. Oh no! Jump down! Ooh. Ah! I jumped too early on that one. Oh, just sleeping on this gigantic, creepy train going down a freaking tunnel at like a million miles an hour. No! Oh, I totally missed the heart. Damn! Sometimes it's a little hard to grab the objects because you have to crouch down and fire kind of in the right spot. Not like 100% in the right spot. It's not like the pickiest thing ever, but as you can see, it can definitely be missed. Let's keep this weapon on us, though. Woo! There we go. Doing pretty good, I think. <laughs> and their cart's just on fire. That is just unfortunate. Jump out! Oh! Is he literally just throwing people out of the train? You're a dick! Got it that time. Do you pick? Do you pick which enemy you fight? I'm very confused. Darn it. I kept trying to make him shoot past me. I kept screwing that up, though. That's alright. That's a good chunk of Gunstar Heroes for today, I think. It's super fun. And once you really just keep getting into it, you learn which weapon combinations you like. You know which, which gun you'd prefer by itself. Which ones you'd prefer together. Like I said, super fun. Now, gonna do another shmup. And Super Fantasy Zone. Which, again, I believe this is a game that... I'm pretty positive, though. This one came out in Japan, but not here. Uh, as were Darius. I'm not sure if it came out both... Or if it came out in Japan, or just not at all on the Genesis. Because I'm pretty sure those were more on, like, the Turbo Graphics. I, th I believe? I don't know. I wouldn't hold me 100% to that because I'm not a shmup connoisseur. I don't really know all this stuff. Just, just a little bit. Enough to get me in trouble. B shoots your machine gun. Looks like C shoots the, uh, the little missiles. Uh-oh. Well, don't run into stuff, John. Oh, there you go. Oh, okay. So you have to destroy each of these flowers. Looks like that little ball is their health. So it goes from blue to red. Got to take it all the way to red. Shop. How does this work? Ooh. Oh, you can. Oh, you can buy new parts. Uh, sweet. 
Let's get some big wings on this mofo. And a wide beam shot. Yeah! Cool! Whoa! Yeah, the big wings make you go faster, as you would expect. And that wide shot, holy crap! It's huge! It's pretty cool that when you're on the ground, little feet come out. Ah! Don't believe it's doing more damage than the other shot. Oh no, did I run out? You only get the wide shot for so long, huh? Hopefully the big wings stay as, as long as I'm alive. Ah! Ah! Keep forgetting that I have a bomb as well. I need to start using that a little bit more. And I believe that flashing on the bottom is like a map. No! Shows where you are and where those big uh, flowers are as well. That's pretty handy. Grab it, grab it. Oh no, I lost my big wings when I died. I assumed that was going to happen, but I was hoping it wouldn't. I wonder how often that little shop balloon comes by. Ah, ah. Ah. There we go. The bomb is the way to go when you're trying to take stuff out quick. Ah, ah. There we go. What, 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 what? Yeah, I got you with the bomb. Give me that shot. A jet engine. Oh, you can keep going down. That's cool. Uh, Thunderbolt. Ooh. Backfire. Heavy bombs. Smart bombs. Nice. Let's uh. Definitely got to get big wings again because those help immensely. Let's try a new kind of weapon. A cheaper one, apparently. Uh, wide beam we've already done. Dang, never mind. Looks like I spent just enough to make it so I couldn't get anything else. Alright, we'll save up. Yes, those big wings. Whoa! Damn, no! Right when I got the big wings! Game over! Ah. This is cool, though. I definitely like the, uh, the idea of beefing up your ship as you play. Those are always my favorite kind of shmups. Instead of the ones where it's just like, oh, you do this. And? And what? This is what you do. This is all you do. So, yeah. I definitely enjoy it when they're, they're like this. And you can upgrade yourself slowly. How long is this shop here? I don't want to risk it. I want the big wings. All right. Back in it. The weapon? Important, yes. But, I feel like these big wings are even more important. And get me out of trouble fast. Oh my gosh. Oh, jumpy little turd. No! Yep. Give me those big wings back. Uh, 
It looks like the screen continuously moves whichever direction you're pointing. So you don't really can... Well, you can push the screen forward, it looks like. But it, you can't just hold the screen still. The screen's always going to move at least a little bit. Ah! Whoa! Oh, oh my gosh. These damn things are what keep messing me up. Both in trying to avoid them and just the damn spinning nature of them. Yeah. Little jumpy butthole. Ah! Bam! Oh, I missed. Bam! I missed again. Bam! There we go. Third time is the charm. <laughs> yeah. I think you're all big and bad with your damn jumpiness. I see you. I now know what to look for. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him out of my way! Ah! Fly! Poop! Those freaking fish just kind of, they trapped me. I had to run away from them. Alright. Now... Find the big wings, and let's see what other kind of weapon we can grab. Let's use the Thunderbolt. That sounds crazy. Sub weapon, huh? How do you use your. Oh! You hit the A button to use your sub weapon. I think I just used it up, though. Crap. I didn't know it was a one time use deal. I'm not going to hit the button again until we're at the boss. Let's get to the boss first, and then I'll try it again. Alright, boss. Yep, it's a one-time use. Crap. I totally wasted it. Whoop. Oh! They don't just explode outward. They explode and twist. No! Okay. We're making it past this freaking boss. We're doing it. Let's do it. Now let's see what the options are first. It's not cheating if I say it's not. You could turn rapid on and off. Yep. We're doing it that way. There we go. That's what's up. I'm sure there are going to be people out there that are like, well, now you're just cheating. You turn the rapid off? Or you turn the rapid on? Oh, no. Come back, shop. Crap. I really want those big wings. Those things are, like, vital. Ah! Ah! Get away from me, you little crap hole. Well, it's not like they make the bombs fall stupid fast, so... That's good. It does make it super cheap. It just makes it so I don't have to constantly push the missile button. Whoa. There we go. Get rid of these damn fish before they try to mess you up. Give me that money. I want the money. Yeah. Whoa. There we go. And he lands right on top of me. Ugh. Okay. Where's the shop? Give me. I'm tempted to try the jet engines. But at the same time, I want to try out a different weapon. So. Looks like purple is sub weapons. Like that special weapon. I believe blue to be your main weapon, red to be like your your bombs, and 
I think that's it. Oh, and then uh, shield, super lights. I don't know what those are. Extra life, of course, and rubber boots. Hmm, what should we try? What should we try? Let's use... Hmm, I don't really shoot the bombs at him. It's hard to hit him as is. Let's just get a big one. Let's use... Backfire. Let's see what it does. Hit me immediately! No! Son of a bitch! Ah. No! I went into it. I went right into the path of it. My goodness. Apparently, I just can't dodge these whatsoever. That was... Wow. Oh my gosh. Okay, focus, focus. Oh, and I got hit by the big seed itself. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! No! I did so bad! <laughs> I even added as many lives as you could get. And I still couldn't beat that guy. You know what? We're trying this one more time. If I do not beat this pumpkin, I will be sad. Come on. Doesn't help when you waste lives right out of the gate. Shoot. No oh, crap. Hold on, people. Hold on. Getting some texts from... From my buddy doing... Uh, over on Artless Retrospect that we do some streaming together. He's just asking if he still if we still want to stream. Uh, I'm telling him yes. Because might as well, right? I'm resetting that though. I started I started bad. I started real bad. My phone was distracting me. Okay, make sure the options are for... Okay, we're at least leaving it on normal. We won't we won't cheese it that much. We won't change it to easy. But, one more shot. Let's beat this damn pumpkin. I need those big wings. Take that, you damn flower petals. Booyah! Just massacring them this time. Determined. There we go. Why? Why do I go forward? Why do I feel like I need to try to dodge going forward if all I would do is just go down? I'd be fine. Go down. Go down. Stay down. There you go. Woo! No! Oh, and I moved into the way of it again! It's the... Oh, man. That curve is messing me up. All right. 
Oh. There we go. Ah. Ah. Straight down. Just straight down, please. Oh my gosh. I keep feeling like, like I have to dodge it. There we go. Whoop. Whew. Straight down. Straight down. Oh. How that did not hit me. Oh no. Oh, I have no clue. Yes! Finally, I beat it! Oh my gosh, that was ridiculous. That's right. 31,000. I'm buying the jet engine. The seven way shot. And I'm curious to see what the super lights are. And the shield. Oh, I can't buy all of it. Okay. No! And I ran right in! No! And everything's gone. Just everything's gone. Come on! Come on! I want a good engine. You cannot deny me my engines. Jet engine at least. Here we go. Laser beam? No. Let's see what this crop... Oh, 20,000. Can't do it. Laser beam? Yes. Here we go. Yeah, suck on that. Who are these little yellow things? No! <laughs> oh, well. That was fun. I mean... For being a very cutesy looking shmup, it's a lot like Defender, uh, where you have to go back and forth. You're not trying to collect anything like in Defender, of course, but having to defeat all of these specific things. And holy crap. That's a blast. And I hate to say it, everyone. This is the last day of me playing Sega Genesis Mini six games a day. And I gotta say... This was so freaking fun. I really appreciate all the newcomers that the Sega Genesis brought into my channel. I appreciate you all showing up. Let me know in any of the comments anywhere, both here on Twitch or on my YouTube, because I got a lot of you on YouTube now as well from doing this. Let me know if you want to see more streaming kind of content or if you enjoy my reviews, because I mean... For my sanity, I love doing the video game reviews, so I'm going to keep doing them no matter what. But, if you, if everybody out there prefers more of this streaming content, I will put in a little bit more effort into it, because right now it's just kind of, I stream when I can, I'll do what I can to make sure I'm on Twitch, uh, and I, I'm not planning on putting all of my, my streams onto YouTube, but if that's what you guys want, Maybe I can just start streaming straight onto YouTube as well. Uh, I don't know if I could do that both on Twitch and YouTube at the same time. That sounds like it would take a supercomputer, and I do not have that. But, either way, just let me know what you guys want. Because I am here, I'm doing all this stuff for my own sanity, but the more people enjoy it, the better. So, hit me up, let me know what you guys think. Go over to my YouTube, which is S-A-H-D, Game Reviews, for Stay At Home Dad. That's, you know, I just wanted to say sad game reviews whenever I talked about it. I feel like it's fun. Uh, but, beyond that, thank you again so much for being here. It's been a blast. And I am sure there are a ton of you out there now looking forward to buying the Sega Genesis Mini, which I believe came out today everywhere it's either today or tomorrow but i'm pretty sure that they said the 19th was when it was officially coming out so you can go out you could go buy one right now i like i said i think i've lost track ever since i was able to get mine 
Which brings me to my special shout out to Level 7 Games. Thank you guys so much for all the support that you give me constantly. And just for being all of you awesome people. I love going into your stores. I love talking to every one of you. And really, for all of you that have not yet been to Level 7 Games, they have three amazing locations here in Denver, Colorado. And seriously, if you love retro gaming, tabletop gaming, or anything really that has to do with those kind of genres, go ahead, hit them up, and you will you will enjoy every minute of it. It's such a fun environment. The people that work there are very intelligent. They know about video games. They know about board games. They know about uh, the card games like Magic and Pokemon. They even have tournaments from time to time where you can win like booster boxes, I believe, is last time I saw something like that. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure they do stuff like that. So seriously, if you love gaming, you gotta check out Level 7 Games if you're here in Denver, Colorado. And thank you all again one last time before I take off. And I will see you all later.